she got this from Timu. And this is the wig she wants me to bleach the knots on. So we're gonna get ready to prepare it off, flip it over. I've got her prepped and everything for her to go to sleep because she got school in the morning. Uh, we've pulled out her little baby hairs. As you can see, everything is blended. We've set the hair for her. Um, the whole little, hold on. I've set the hair for her. Everything is blended in there, see? And now we're pulling down the parts because she want to cut her baby hairs herself, so that's fine. We do that. I've already prepped her glued her down right here in the front. I really just sew, I sewed it everywhere and just glued her down. If you look really, really close, let's see. Right there, you can see the lace. But I brush all my baby hairs back. But these children, they want baby hairs. So good night, y'all. So this never lasts in the house. So I'm doing two pots of it. My baby just came and asked me because she go to church tonight with her friend. Now out of respect, she's asking because she goes where I was like, yes, but you don't have to ask me to go to church. Um, even though like when I was a teenager, it was a lot of people because I, I stayed in church. It was a lot of people that used to sneak and say they was going to church and going to other places and they ass wasn't in church. I was there because I was playing the piano for everybody. We usually do it over rice. Today we're gonna to do it over noodles. Love, so many people use your name in vain. Oh, love, those who have faith in you sometimes go astray. Oh my goodness. How is this even possible? So simple, so simple, so simple. Alright y'all, so today's President's Day. It's no school for the kids. I'm actually about to go work out. Although my allergies are going, y'all, look. I can't. I don't know. I don't know where I'm gaining it. What's going on. But tummy wise... I'm so thick in the stomach right now, so it's like ridiculous. Since this is my first day back, I'm just gonna do some up and downs the fields, right? I'm gonna run to the end over there, walk back. When I get here, run, walk back, and I'm gonna just do that for about maybe 15, 20 minutes. And because I have a 20 minute run according to Nike Run app, so um, that's what I'm gonna do just to kind of build up because today I'm moving weight that I've never hit before. I've never been this heavy, so. Let's get out here and jumpstart ourselves into what it is we're supposed to be doing.
this ain't no joke. Usually after I take my shower and everything like that, I'm a Vaseline girl, Vaseline from head to toe. I'm about to get ready to moisturize my face. And then um, because my hair is wet, I'm not gonna put it in a ponytail or a wig. I'm just gonna brush it back, run upstairs, get my NARS foundation and my blush. And we just gonna do something simple. You Mr. the nasty, I clean it up. Oh my God, if this, you know what? Let's, let's be with the shits. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hello. Hi, how are you? I'm great. Are you calling me for a specific reason? That's best thing to do. Okay. So I'm going to ask that you don't call me. I don't know you. I mean, he was fucking up my Beyonce. All right, so my hair is back in a little bun. Um, and that's my makeup. Just, it's not really, it's soft, but still natural, right? So that's the look we're going for. I mixed like a orange and pink blush together to get this color. Um, it's out of my, it's a hair and blush. Volume 11 palette. The other palette, I think it's volume, I mean that's volume two. Volume one palette has that like real, real orange in there. I love a wispy lash. So the lashes I have on, Kiss, so wispy. Um, super, super natural looking. And fitting for today's makeup. It's me. Not even getting half the shit done that I was trying to get done today because of the family, but it's okay. My baby's graduation stuff is here. I'm so happy. I gotta graduate, y'all. I'm in here in my bra. Mm. So they want Rotel. Duh. So they have left to go and get Rotel. Tomorrow's the 28th. I got a half day. I might bring y'all with me to this half day job um, tomorrow. See if y'all like that or not. Well, in the meantime, happy Tuesday. I'm in here just doing some cleaning up stuff before I get ready to go to work for this half day that I picked up. I got a bag of clothes right here that my daughter wants to donate. So I'm just going to go through this whole bag and fold them then put them back um, into the bag. Then I need to hurry up and get myself together because I'm supposed to report for like 12, 15. All right, y'all. Catch y'all in a few. All right, y'all, I had to turn on the fan in here because it was a little on the toasty side. Hopefully she doesn't pop back in while I'm vlogging. Your girl pulled together nicely, huh? All right, so let's put me name on the board. This is kind of like what I consider my sub outfits because you know the little kids, the little boys, especially in intermediate and up, maybe the way they try to get with the teachers. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Fashion over jacket. Dress is actually from Rainbow. Had to put the jacket on because it has the little slits on the side. Y'all have seen this dress before. But it's super comfy and elastic and loose and flowing. So it shows absolutely no curves. Flip flops and call it a day. He done gave Sabrina the 1.5 for Maurice on Sisters. Now, what price is that going to come at? Ooh, massaging my hair, y'all. My scalp. It stimulates hair growth. Grind and shit. I have to call my friend. My boyfriend was telling me about it. Okay. I'm going to call him now. Okay. What do you say? Yes. 
the big numbers for banks. Here. Okay. This is what the house looks like. That's gorgeous. Bird Street's modern, sexy. We're essentially selling them the not built, so they can't even inspect them. Right. So they have a contractor like attached to the project to build everything out? Yeah. And so what's cool about it is you can deliver your client to them. Mm -hmm. That's it. You're done. What do you need? Oh my god. I have a glass of wine. This is like a slam dunk. <laughs> okay. Do anything other than bring That's it. Don't y'all touch this pot, it's hot. I should have sprayed my pot before I um, put my fish in there. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So that's your little tassel. Class of 2023, we got to go. Look, you going to put this on? No, I told you, if I don't like the way it looks, I'm not going to wear it. Okay. Finky, you move. <laughs> Good morning, y'all. I'm gonna talk to y'all about like some rosemary and mint hair shampoo. Um, I also want to try to find some mushroom coffee this morning, and then I'm just showing y'all like I'm doing minimal um, makeup. And and I shouldn't really even say makeup because this is when I literally just throw on a lash. I leave my natural brow. I just put face primer on you know like how you prime your face before you do um i'm sorry for the shakiness how you prime you how you prime your face prior to doing your makeup i'll do face primer and then i'll just throw on a lip gloss or a tinted lip gloss or maybe even a little lipstick if it's not going to clash with my natural skin so right now I'm just putting on the Fenty Heat Balm. This one, I think this was the, uh, I can't remember the name of this one. But it's the one that's red. All right, so that gives you like the look. And typically if you don't even want to wear a wig, put your hair in a ponytail or a bun. It's always something cute. A high bun too would be really cute. Everything Fashion Nova, Gucci. Luby Kiss is my perfume for today. This scent will last literally all day and these are gonna be my shoes of choice of poison this morning um i am gonna bring like a change of shoe because if you know anything about a, a red bottom even though these are the hot chicks these and the, i think it's isra i-s-r-a those are my two most comfortable pairs of damn it don't you hate when this happens pairs of um red bottoms but that's just kind of like what I want to wear today. And I'm going to bring my Louboutin tote. Yeah, I'm having a dilemma. Now, I know I just said my toes not done. But, with shoe. Hot chick. Mew. I'm thinking maybe the mule. Even though my toes ain't done. All right, we are in Sprouts. And... Let's go see. I might even get some sushi while I'm in here. Okay, so I'm looking for this mushroom coffee. I currently see, this is so cute. It says Organic Bitches, Bitches Brew. They have this one. It's for memory and immunity. It's Vitacup with Focus, Lion's Mane, Chag of Vitamins, Medium Dark, Premium Ground Coffee. It's a mushroom power. So let's keep looking. You see that one. And the one I was looking for said four something. So give me a sec, y'all. I think I'm going to get this one because it's the only one that I see. All right. So I got my teas and my stuff from Sprout, my coffees that I was looking for. Y'all, I look good to that girl. Don't show me. <laughs> and I got my baby over here driving and she told me not to show her, but I'm going to show y'all. We're going to do vlog style. Boom. God damn, I'm on the speed bump. I'm sorry. I was going so bad. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Pray for me. <laughs> she goes like 10 miles an hour over the speed bumps. I'm like, baby, please do at least four. This almost looks like my, my vehicle that I sold, y'all, but I don't think that's an X7. Oh, I, mean, I think that's an X5. I liked that. Oh, that was an X7, but it's yeah, still it not. Ours was like the top top. We had the m50i x7 sport it was the, the soup soup now tony the goal is to get across the street 
That's going to be the parking lot with Sally's. Oh, Lord. Oh, Jesus. I'm going to take y'all along for the ride. Y'all going to get real life action real quick. Now, we're stopping. So, first set of traffic. Look, God done cleared away for you. Go ahead. We're going into the median. Because there's nothing coming. Look how God worked. Now, you're going to yield. And then over here, when you can go, you're going to go straight ahead. No, 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 Tony. You're not that strong. How much you can go after him? What the hell? We're going to let these cars pass. But when we got our opportunity, we will go. Mm -mm. Now, see, if you were a strong enough driver, you probably could have. No, that would have been pushing it. Don't listen to mommy. That's some of that Texas driving coming out. After this blue car, go. 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 We're going to wait till they come in no, right here and hit us. Okay. okay. Whew. Y'all, we're going to, we going to, we going to, Jesus. We're going to hook back up, okay? <laughs> wait, Tony. We're going to, I'm going to pick y'all back up. We're going to. Now. Five, five <laughs> with the car in park and then you get out and look at how you you parked us so i told her put it in park we start going to drive then we go in reverse i was really coming on to show y'all my spring rolls we can go up yeah it's only because you just backed up but you have to be in your line i'm in the line the, the front of the car can't be all out in the street. Sure, all right. Fine. Do you want to taste one? They're really good. No, you dip it in the Polynesian. No, I, I don't, I don't like it's just a lettuce wrap. No, it's not I, even sushi. No, I'm okay. All right, y'all. So these are spring rolls. This is this shit is good. Come on, Tony. Put the windows up. We have made it safely to our destination. Woo -hoo. I didn't told them look presentable when you go in public. Hey, Here. I didn't have enough time. Uh, yeah. What you want to do, Come on. Yeah. I say walk with y'all. With y'all. Come on. Walk with y'all. Everybody, everybody. Do that, Kelly. Yo, walk, Kelly. Yo, walk, Kelly. Do that, Kelly. Rosemary and mint shampoos. They used to sell them in here. Do you see any? I see coconut. I see everything. So Miel does have one. It's a very small one. Um, they have the conditioner, the, sh the shampoo. They have the whole set. They even have the drops, which that would be good, especially to use with a head massager. If you go into Sally's, you look for your silk elements. Um, I'm not seeing it today, but they do have it. And it comes in a really big bottle like this. And it'll be like rosemary and peppermint oil. And it's really good for y'all's hair. Hello. And so, right today, they have like the, the jojoba oil shampoo. I mean, you still have they have the vitamin E out. They have the moisturizing. They have one called Pure Oils. Silk Elements is really good, y'all. All right. So, I don't see it today. I'm going to go online and see if I can get it that way and purchase it like that, okay? And these are like $13 bottles for 33 um, ounces, y'all. So definitely don't don't cheat yourself. All right, so we're looking for plums now. I see apples, baby. I don't see any plums out. They have some pears. Uh, apricots are pretty good, but are they ripe is the question. I know the difference. Peach has bugs on it. Apricot does not. Cool. This is... Everything that we kind of grab from the store, I'm gonna go through it really quick. Just wanna have a good night, hold it. Don't know that low. Extend up. 
If you want these, you gotta let me bitches like a perk go. Like Anybody, any money, mo. Cause when you a boss, you can do what you want. Uh, yeah. Don't play with it, don't play with it. Don't play with it, don't play with it. Uh, yeah, I remember some of my earlier vlogs when I used to vlog. Um, I would come over here, right over here to this dollar store behind me. And I'd have my kids take, uh, like I actually have a picture or a video. It's like a haul with me sitting right there um, getting pictures and stuff in that area. So, yeah, you could definitely do it. Are you trying to pull in? Oh, you're right there? Oh, okay. Hold on. Let me move out the way because I think they're trying to. You're trying to get in? Do I need to move? Oh, okay. You sure? Okay. Big boobs in a bus, they pump. She a baddie, she knows she a 10. She a baddie with her baddie friend. They like, I tell you, always stay hot. Oh, they mad cause I keep making bops. Oh, she mad cause I'm taking her spot. If I was bitches, I'd hate me a lot. She a baddie with her baddie friend. She a baddie with her baddie friend. She a baddie with her baddie friend. She a baddie, she knows she a 10. Yeah, let me tell y'all something. Let me show you when you least expect it how God works, right? So, y'all know I'm always talking about networking, meeting people that do social media, YouTube, all of this. I was like in my house about to cook, and I was like, you know what? Let me run, go take my pictures, try to get this thumbnail. I come out here, and lo and behold, these two girls roll up on me like, hey, what you doing? I was like, oh, I'm about to vlog. They was like, okay, we do the same shit. So we chop it up, we talking the whole thing like this. Like it, it's just, let me just say it like this. It's just a blessing because when you put stuff into the universe when you really pray and you ask god for certain things you'll know if it's not the path you're supposed to be on because let me tell you if you're thinking about quitting if you're thinking about y'all just keep going because you just never know what opportunity is waiting on you get up and just go do what it is you're gonna do because you just never know what's gonna pop off for you at that time so that's all i'm gonna say um i will be linking up with them hopefully this weekend um well most likely it will be this weekend and just pretty much go from there and they were just like telling me like some of the stuff they do and some of the stuff i should do and some of the people they could you know put me on to and stuff like this so i it was like that was cool all right y'all i'm winding down for the night bed clothes this is what i'm wearing for tonight i'm in here doing some cabbage grilled pork chops yellow rice that's the meal it's kind of late we're on spring break, so we all like out of order as far as how we eating and what we doing. Um, I had a very productive day, very blessed day. I hope y'all had the same. All right, y'all, happy Thursday. Excuse how I look right now. I just came from working out this morning, doing a morning run. I'll try to film that for y'all tomorrow. I currently am getting ready to um, go in for a job that I have this morning at 11. And it's about 9.20-ish, something like that. So I'm in here trying to clean up after all the little things that were in here yesterday. And I'm actually about to wash this wig so that I can kind of um, put it on this morning because it has a little bit of glue and C22 in it. I'll come home and do dishes because it's only a half day job for me. So let me get all that going and I'm going to catch y'all. Uh, all right, y'all. So I'm not going to have time to do makeup and stuff like that. But um, I did put the wig on and it is very much wet because I don't really have time to blow dry it. I put a little bit of Eben's glue right there and I'm not tying it down. I got to go and try to just... Um, just try to get myself together. Um, this one is from D Hair Boutique. <sighs> y'all, now as a stylist, I take care of all my stuff. I think I've talked about this before on my channel. I would not suggest buying stuff from D Hair Boutique unless um, you know for sure it just shipped in or something. Because I don't know if it's, and then I probably still wouldn't. Um, especially not at their prices. Like I never ever buy hair because I always sold hair. But you know, I wanted to support a business, so I bought um, two wigs from them, and I bought bundles from them. All of it tangled, except for the straight bundles that I bought from them. That was the only ones that didn't tangle. It tangles really bad. You lose a lot of hair. It's a lot of shedding, um, and that's real. That's facts. Um, 
I know they have Angela Simmons as like a spokesperson for them and everything like that. But I'm just telling y'all, even just now, I'm, I'm going to show y'all the ball of hair of me just finger combing through um, for a hair wig that I had um, that just should not be tangled up like this. All right. This is after me balling it up. This is after me balling it up, y'all. So definitely, definitely, I would not suggest purchasing um, their products. Now, this is also like their Sea Wave or something like that. Um, it's so pretty straight out the box, but you definitely smell like the little older, see? I bought two wigs and that, and then like a long, long time ago, I bought straight hair from them. Um, don't do it. That's not me knocking another business, y'all. That's just me telling you if you're here in the Dallas-Fort Worth area, don't do it. All right, y'all. So I have made it to school, as you guys can see. Um, I did go ahead and do some light makeup just so that I would look presentable. And this wig is still drying, but honey, we got it together. I put on a long, um, kind of like flowing maxi dress. It's not too fitted. Jean, oversized jean crop top jacket. And um, that's pretty much what I'm doing. It is nothing spectacular. So literally just this dress, maxi dress. It's long to the floor. Um, I even put a girdle underneath so that you don't see anything and call it a day. All right, y'all, we're gonna stop at What A Burger because it's right across the street. I am wanting a jalapeno burger so bad. Oh my God, I hope it's under 10 because baby, all I got on me is $10. I left everything else at the house. So we're going to see. <clears throat> thank you. And y'all put ketchup in there? Yes. Oh, thank you. Slowly turn left, and there you stood. You and your friends talking. But when our eyes connect, I knew then it was just like two ways on beam. I'm your king, be my queen. And whatever you want to do tonight, my truck is parked out front, so let's ride. I can reach your mind, babe. Oh, I know what you're thinking. I know what you're thinking, baby. Don't play with it, don't play with it, don't 
play with They stay with I'm okay with y'all It's when they come to me, they don't play with They don't play with They don't play with As a licensed cosmetologist, a lot of times um, I would get clients, right, that wanted to do boudoir shots for their husbands, boyfriends, so forth. And the issue that a lot of the women would have when they would come in is, oh, God, I'm so nervous. Oh, how do I be sexy? What do I wear? Different things like this. So I want to start off by just telling y'all, like, it does not always have to be lingerie. So here are some things that I've suge suggested to clients that I've had before. So number one, like one of the very first things that you guys can do um, that you can pack in your bag uh, when you go for your shoot is you can pack a sheet or like a blanket, something cozy. And the reason I say this is because if you're going to sit and you're going to take the picture, you can wrap yourself in a blanket or a sheet instead of just traditionally um, coming in lingerie. Another thing that you guys can wrap bring if you are um, worried about like your midsection or anything like that. And y'all could just take this little walk with me while we kind of talk. Um, another thing you guys can bring is say like a sweater, right? You can do like a sweater with fishnet stockings. You can do um, jeans with no shirt, right? Get like the cute little back shot or a, sh a shot from the front. Um, what else? Of course, your traditional like button down shirt, you can do that. Um, a lot of people always do that. They'll do like the guy's shirt. But I think it's sexier when you do like one of your own shirts because it's more fitted. And so it doesn't give that overly baggy look that you get with like the button down shirts, right? So if you do like one of your button downs, it's more fitted. And so then what happens is... Um, it squeezes kind of like in those places but still gives you that coverage that you're looking for paired with a classy heel right i'm walking out to the corner um because i figured like this would be a little chatty so i didn't want y'all to feel like we were just sitting right um what else can you do what else have i suggested in the past um jeans i've talked about bringing blankets um doing your own button down shirt instead of his um of course like you can always do a hat um and you can and um, a hat <laughs> and when i say a hat i'm meaning like um a brim hat not like a baseball cap or something like that um and use your own imagination when it comes to that what else of course you can do body stockings body stockings always kind of like just cover your body but they're still like super super sexy and then of course you can go into your traditional lingerie um another fun thing you could do for those is like probably one of my faves that i suggested to people is buy ribbon and what i mean by ribbon like get a bow and tie yourself in an actual bow or get like um the black electrical tape and make an outfit out of that tape those are just some things you guys can do i know y'all enjoyed my last um boudoir talk type video and i've been asked actually to do something along that lines again as far as telling women how to be comfortable in your skin and stuff like that so that's the only reason that i'm kind of talking about it today because y'all always come in and be like do this again do this again do this again so here we are now with that being said i do have two lingerie hauls that i would like to do one is with fashion nova and one is with shop love vera and y'all they are so overdue um come on i'm gonna show y'all how uh i personally style all my lingerie i could store it in my armor but i don't i typically just hang them in my closet all of my robes starting in the front and then from there i go with all of my outfits now some of them are being currently washed so i have my golds my reds my pinks to peaches right blue is my favorite color so i definitely have all my blues y'all kind of get the idea i got this whole section of black and then I go into all of my robes, right? I have my long robes. I have that. 
Now that is another thing that you can do. You could just do a robe. I like the, I call it the Tony Braxton style, right? Um, I like to drape my my robe off of one shoulder, cinch it in the middle, and then um just kind of have that out. Um, it's all in how you move, where you talk, your gestures, things like that. I personally have never done a boudoir. Um photo shoot but i have been on boudoir, boudoir photo shoots and i have done hair for boudoir photo shoots the next thing i would tell you is do not style your hair do not come to me who's the, the hair stylist and be like oh i want something extra extra no stay with what actually um you feel comfortable with and that will also give you like another thing to do so like if you're not really an updo person why would you come in and get an updo if you're not normally wearing your hair in a ponytail, why would you come in and what, you know, you want something flirty with movement um, so that when you do certain little moves, so that when you look certain little ways, when you catch the camera and you angle back, you have, um, you know, you that, that confidence is there for y'all. Why are you so ashy? I doubt you said it on the car. No, the packaging, I mean. Somewhere. At the beach? I swear. What's the thing about like, do, 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 I can't remember. <laughs> I don't know any condom companies that start with that, that uh, name. So. Yeah. 
is him stealing oh, tons of flowers. Let's go, bro. <laughs> come on. <laughs> is it, he's picking flowers you didn't even ask for. Oh, he's oh, in the dirt. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh. we don't want oh. the dirt. We, we don't want the dirt in the car. We should get in the car. <laughs> in the car. <laughs> get him. Oh, oh, oh shit. Drive away. I, I can't take Drive it close away. as the door, correct? Drive away. Oh, it's it's the. I might as well go home and plant that one because you got the roots and everything. Yeah, that's what I said. Why did you do You got the bulbs. Oh, that's good. Don't. No, uh-uh. Because them bulbs can go in the ground. Oh. Him got me a flower. I thought you was just going to break it from the top. You pulled like it out of the ground. But that's that's even better because I can hopefully plant those. You know, I've always wanted a piece of this magnolia tree. Mother. No more. Mother. No more. Oh, Lord. Bye. You can say what you want. I'm the shit. <laughs> so look. There he is. Damn, he fell down. He fell down and shit. Don't fall in front of me. I ain't trying to. And I done got it on camera too. <laughs> Tony, did you say it's them drugs? <laughs> it is out here. They on canes and shit. What they cook? Oh, they got drink for it. So. We in stop six. So. Well, we actually are. But, uh, this is why I don't like to come to this lake in particular. He like to, I don't. You're just stuck in here and everybody just drive around to look at each other. And that's what it is. So, we've been here about 30 minutes now just trying to get out. It's been on damn 30 minutes. It's been 30 minutes. It's been on damn 30 minutes. It's been, we got here at 6. It's 625. It's Six, we got here at six. It's six twenty-five. So in five minutes, it'll be. We've been here thirty minutes. Oh yeah, it's seven twenty-five. I gotta reset the car, car thing. That's my cue to go on.